Welcome to the Soccer Tavern, where we're discussing the history, culture, and philosophy of the beautiful game. My name is Dave, and in this video, we're talking about the history of the Iran men's national soccer team. Pull up a seat, and let's start the discussion. Iran is a country with a population of about 82 million people. It's located in the Middle East, so southwestern Asia. The National Soccer Federation belongs to AFC, which is the Asian Confederation in FIFA. The Iran men's national team plays its home matches at the Azadi Stadium in Tehran, which holds about 85,000 people. Iran's National Soccer Federation is named the Football Federation Islamic Republic of Iran, or FFIRI for short. The first attempts at forming a national federation came in 1921 by two men named Mir Bagar Khan Azimi and Abalfi Zadri. That organization eventually folded. But by 1946 or 1947, the FFIRI was established by Mohammad Reza Pahlavi, who was the Reza Shah's son. The Reza Shah was the monarch and ruler of Iran at that time. The Iran national team has two nicknames, Team Meli and Sharan e Pers. The Team Meli nickname literally just means the national team in Persian, and the Sharan e Pars nickname means the Persian Lions in Persian. The National Federation crest is pretty straightforward. It's the Iran national flag on top of a soccer ball. The text in Arabic and English is the Federation name, and the country's name in English is at the top of the soccer ball. Quick history on the country's flag. The colors of red and green are traditional colors of Arab states. The words Allah o Akbar, meaning God is great, are repeated on the flag 22 times representing the Islamic revolution. The symbol in the center is made up of four crescents and a sword. These five items represent the five pillars of Islam. Also, the design in the middle is a complex set of symbols that can be read as the word Allah in Arabic. It could also be a symbol for the globe or it could be interpreted as two crescents. The flag is pretty fascinating, so if you're interested in learning more, I encourage you to check out our sources in the video description below. Iran has appeared at five World Cup finals tournaments, including the 2018 World Cup. The country's best ever finish came in 1978, when the country came in 14th place. From a continental competition perspective, Team Meli has played in 13 AFC Asian Cups. The country won the Asian Cup on three occasions, 1968, 1972, and 1976. Team Meli qualified for the 2018 World Cup by winning Group A of the AFC World Cup qualification ahead of South Korea. The country has been placed in Group B of the 2018 World Cup group stage. Three of the best Iranian players in history were Ali Dai, Ali Karimi, and Javad Nukhanam. Ali Dai is the greatest Iranian soccer player in history. He scored an international record 109 goals and 148 caps, and also won Asian Footballer of the Year in his career. Ali Karimi was nicknamed the Asian Maradona because he had incredible ball control and would go on mazy dribbling runs. He played for Team Meli from 1998 to 2013 and was named Asian Footballer of the Year in 2004. Lastly, Javad Nukunam was a long-serving captain and midfielder for Iran from 2000 to 2015. He had a great career and is the all-time cap leader for Iran. And for the 2018 World Cup, the star player to keep your eye on is Sardar Azmoun, who is a 23-year-old center forward who plays for Rubin Kazan in Russia. He has 22 international goals and only 30 appearances. And a breakout player for this tournament is Saman Godos, who can play as a center forward or attacking midfielder. He plays his club soccer currently for Ostersunds FK in Sweden. He's rumored to be being tracked by Premier League clubs and could move to a big club if things go well this tournament, so keep an eye on him. Iran's two main rivals are Saudi Arabia and Iraq. Both Saudi Arabia and Iran have been two of the best soccer nations from Western Asia for decades. The battle for supremacy on the soccer field also is fueled by a natural and political rivalry between the two countries and their populations. Iran's Muslim population is predominantly Shiites, while Saudi Arabia's Muslim population is mainly Sunnis. The two countries have never played a friendly and matches are always intense. 
The Iraq rivalry comes from the two neighboring countries and their political instability over the last 40 years or so. Until as recently as 2017, neither country had played on the other country's home soil for decades. Because of the political differences and historical conflicts, this is one of the biggest rivalries in Western Asia. Officially, according to FIFA, there are two players that are tied for the most caps in Iran's history. They are Javad Nukunum with 148 caps and Ali Dai who also had 148 caps. Now I found some other sources that had Javad Nukunum with 151 caps, so I'm going to give him the edge here. Part of that is because Ali Dai is the country's all-time record goal scorer. He had 109 goals in his career. And one last interesting fact about Iran, the Iranian Federation claims the country's first ever international match came in 1926, but FIFA officially recognizes the country's first ever match as happening against Afghanistan in 1941. So there you have it, a bit of history on the Iran men's national team. If you have anything else to add to our discussion, please let us know in the comment section below the video. Thanks for stopping by the Soccer Tavern. Hope to see you again soon. Cheers!